and welcome back to another episode of Trinity Adventures. This week we're going to be hooking up the Lycan. We got our transfer switch in, so let's do it. We got our transfer switch. Um, we're going to be installing it with the Lycan, so yeah, let's do it. We got our Lycan in place and we're hooking up the transfer switch to our electrical box. We're just um, running these wires through here from the transfer switch into our electrical box. And the Lycan will uh, plug into this and act as our backup home solar generator. And here you can see the switches are labeled A, B, C, D, E, and they match up with the wiring here. You can see the little C on there and they all have a uh, letter corresponding. You just want to clip your wires to the length you want. We wet, left a little extra length because we will be rewiring this box later on once we finish all of our electrical in our yurt, but it's not done yet. Depending on your setup choice, ours being emergency backup, we're going to now wire the black wire from the transfer switch to the appliance wire in the main panel using wire connectors as you can see here. And now we're going to wire the transfer switch to the selected breakers. Then we are going to wire the red wire from the transfer switch to the main panel breaker that the appliance was wired to originally. As you can see here, we are wiring four backup breakers for one of our mini splits, our water pump, refrigerator, and three outlets allowing us to run our TV, lights, coffee maker, and more. And guys, don't forget, if you're not going to have a professional do this, before you start doing any of this, it, like we showed in the beginning, um, cut the power before wiring anything you're doing. And like I said before, our um, electrical box is kind of a mess right now because we are not done with all doing all of our electrical stuff in our yurt. And once we are done, we are going to uh, reorganize it and probably shorten these wires up some. We are still completing our bathroom, our floors in our yurt. Um, we have so much more to do, but... So much more, but yet we've come so far to the point where we're almost there to the point of being done. And then we can start on building things for the outside, which will be really cool to watch for you guys. Hard for us and sucky to do. And here we're just um, going to connect the ground and neutral wires as well. Also, disclaimer, we are not professionals. We are self-taught on everything we have learned as we go along. My husband is a mechanical design engineer um, for EV and electronic uh, car devices. But that doesn't mean at all that we um, are professionals in this category. But we have learned as we have went along and I'm sure you can as well. I just wanted to throw that out there because nothing uh, we've done on our channel is done by a professional. It's all done by us and we want to show that you can learn to do anything you put your mind to and you can build your off-grid homestead however you want to. Um, if you just do enough research and spend enough time you can make any dream possible. And you can make our dreams possible by liking and subscribing to our channel. You can also follow me at Whitney.Wildflower on Instagram and TikTok. We appreciate all the love you guys show us. And we love getting all your messages. Um, you can reach out to me on Instagram. And I try to message everyone back with any um, questions that you guys might have. And then we flipped on the switches and plugged our lichen into the transfer switch. And then here I am just flipping the switch, turning on the inverter, closing it up, turning it around and turning on the batteries. And that is it. It is good to go as our home backup. 
Now we're charging this with an AC charger with our uh, solar array outside, but you can hook um, solar panels directly into it. And here is the cord running from the transfer switch, and it runs out to the lichen on the outside here of our loft uh, bathroom. That is not complete yet, but here is the screen. And as you can see, we're charging the Phoenix 200 power station with our uh, lichen here. And then we go outside to see our beautiful solar array by Renogy. And that is it, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Remember, you are loved and you are meant to be on this earth. We love you. Thanks so much. Bye.